Sky as a comic book superhero who's lost everyone he loves to his author's whims. Jace is the brilliant teen math whiz and comic book aficionado who's just trying to survive high school without getting beat up because of his dad's job. When some very literal plot holes drop Sky into Jace's universe, Sky's finally got a chance to punish his author for killing his family, driving his best friend insane, and turning every girl he's ever known into a deadly plot point. Sky sets out to murder his author. Jace's dad becomes the detective on Sky's case. Jace has got to decide between his family and his friend, between the real world he's always hated and the comic book world he's always loved. If anyone can stop Sky from killing again, it's Jace. If he doesn't get involved first, then a feline supervillain has fallen Sky into the real world with hopes of kidnapping the author and becoming the comic world's god. Between the villains, the nightmares, the Italian food, and the deadly secret that Jace hides, Sky's got to decide before he goes insane. Will murdering his creators save his world? or damn his soul. Hi, I'm sci-fi writer and mad literary scientist Jen Finelli. And this is my laboratory. And I'm going to blend a comic book with a book and create an abomination of literature the likes of which the world has never seen. So I'm crowdfunding to pay an artist to put a comic book inside the Becoming Hero novel so that when Jace reads his comics, you're reading them too. And as Sky is moving back and forth between his memories of the comic book world and the real world, you are also engaging in that media in a very physical way. I love that. I love transmedia stuff. We're also doing an audio rendition. And one of my voice actors, John Chrysalis, who's a longtime friend of mine, actually just recently got nominated for a voice award in Canada. So a lot of really professional stuff coming down the pipe. But I, you know, want to be able to pay these people fairly since I used to work as a freelancer myself full time. And I understand, you know, what it's like to put work into something and want to get paid for it. So that's important to me. And representation of diversity within superhero media is kind of a buzzword that makes people either very excited or very angry. I really think it's about seeing ourselves and all of us with the potential to become heroes. Throughout my life, there have just been these different heroes who have always impacted me. And my heroes have never been in one certain demographic. That's never a thing that I grew up with. My parents were told not to get married because they were two different races. That immigrant mindset that they have, that mindset of like the whole world is our home, everybody is my brother and sister, has made it so that I don't really see a reason to limit the kinds of heroes that we have because that's just not my real life experience. Some of you have suffering that you've gone through that I can't even begin to fathom. The things that I've dealt with, like, you know, suffering with my handicapped siblings, or the death of my brother this year, or the deaths of everybody over the past four years, it's been a really strange four years for me. All the kind of, you know, when you're texting a girl and you find out that she's been dead because she was stabbed to death in an alleyway, and that's not why she's, that's why she wasn't responding to your texts. Things like that just this is part of being human we lose people we gain new friends and i'd be really excited to see kind of relationships form as we work together to do some different charity projects and to dialogue about suffering and authorship and what if there's something bigger out there and what that means for human suffering because it's a big scary question and i'm really passionate about being a part of you guys' lives and I think it'd be really cool if you guys want to take a moment to be part of mine. Click that button somewhere. Let me know if you want in and if you want cool stuff because I'm down to give you that. Alright.